Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jamie, your crafty DIY guy, and I'm back. I've got a great idea for a very cool looking industrial mirror that kind of reminds me a lot of this pendant light that you see up here. And uh, the only thing you're gonna need is one of these round Dollar Tree mirrors and some popsicle sticks. So let's get started. <laughs> First, go ahead and separate your mirror and the frame from that cardboard backing. Put your mirror and your frame aside and then just flip that backing face down. I wanted to go ahead and make sure that my popsicle sticks started off evenly. So I marked it almost like a clock, 12 o'clock, three o'clock, six o'clock and nine o'clock. That way I knew where to start with my sticks. And then once I went ahead and glued the 12, three, six, and nine, then I started to just kind of fill in the quote unquote numbers in between the sticks, making sure to keep them evenly spaced and about the same distance all the way around the circle. And once it was done, this is what the back side looks like. Now, I did go ahead and put this aside and let it dry really well. And then I went to the next step, which was pulling out my furniture polish, yes. I use old English furniture polish when I'm doing any small projects like this. It's an easier cleanup. It comes off of my hands really easy, and I really like the texture and the color I get from staining the popsicle sticks this way. Then while those were drying, I went ahead and just did the popsicle sticks that I was going to need for the front side of my frame. For these particular sticks, it was important to get both sides of the sticks so I did go ahead and just, once again, use my old English furniture polish and stained both sides of these popsicle sticks. Next thing I wanted to do was give my frame a more kind of matte finish. So I used black chalk paint. And then it was time to glue the mirror back to the cardboard backing. Now, because of these sticks, this is not going to be a perfectly smooth and it's not going to fit perfectly back onto here. So it's important that you do use a nice, generous amount of your hot glue. That way your mirror and frame will stay glued on to the sticks and to the backing itself. Now it's time to start layering your popsicle sticks on the front side. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna match up the ends of your popsicle sticks and then glue them forward, overlapping on the frame, working your way all the way around the frame. Once you've done that and you've let them dry, go ahead and reinforce it with some additional sticks on the backside and simply just trim the sticks down as needed. That way you can get some good coverage and you can make sure that these sticks stay in place and that your frame is going to be nice and sturdy. Once you've done that, this is what it looks like when it's all done. I love the way this looks. I think it's a perfect complement to my office. It's got a cool tribal vibe and I'm really, really digging it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up and tell your friends about me. Thanks so much. Take care.